Hello everybody, my name is Sledge, and welcome back to Fallout 4. So now we gotta attend a directorate meeting, or some stupid shit, because uh, my son decides he wants to be lazy as fuck and just pass all his work on to me now, because who the fuck knows why? He's retired, I guess. Ow. This is actually a pretty small reactor. If I do have to, if I know anything about nuclear science, this is a fucking small reactor to power the entire institute. Hey, assholes, out of my way! Are you fucking serious? Move! Jesus Christ! Slow, motherfuckers. Don't point your shit at me. Can I just be an asshole and betray the Institute? Can I do that? Because I like what they're doing, but I don't... I don't agree with their methods. I don't. I'm glad you talked... I need to talk to someone about a situation up north. Pleasure to meet you. William Mosley, Advanced Systems. Oh, God damn I'm it. happy to help in whatever capacity I can. What's this shit? I hope I don't disappoint. I'm sure you'll be fine. Thank you. I'm eager to help, though admittedly I'm a bit lacking in field experience. Place called Acadia. No, 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 Actually, no. Never mind. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna root out Acadia. No, no. What the fuck? Put that fucking gun down, asshole. Let me go talk to the fucking... More than just our leader. Shut up! Our Jesus Christ. Okay. Hey, asshole. Yeah, but, but. This is father's room, ain't it? Yeah. Sorry, son. So I didn't mean to just fucking... It's up there. Fucking hell. I hate the layout of this place so much. I forget where my own room even is. Hey, be more as at. Here I am looking like Shredder. We beginning? Alright. What kind of work? will we be doing exactly? Well, normally the directorate reviews and approves research tracks for the various divisions. Today, however, <sighs> we're here for a different reason. Right now we're all here because it's finally time to stand up for ourselves. Let's not be dramatic, Justin. There's nothing dramatic about it. We're in a position to push back, to assert ourselves here. You guys well, just turned on a reactor and you think you can push. Speed? Obviously there are groups in the Commonwealth that stand in opposition to the Institute's goals. With the reactor now online, we have the ability to not only expand synth production, but to project power to a much greater degree. Improve life. What's the goal? Where are you going with this? What's the Institute's goal? Well... The Directorate has agreed that steps must be taken to ensure our safety in the So world. eliminate hostility? Around the, bush. the Directorate has agreed that the Brotherhood of Steel needs to be eliminated. Okay, I agree with that one. Director, we felt it important to inform you of the decision and get your thoughts on it. So, where do you stand? Okay, so, this is where the tactician and me must decide, regardless whatever we do, is most likely end up in major conflict anyway. Uh, avoid conflict, minimize the violence, hit them hard. Hitting them hard will have a lot of casualties on both sides. However, we'll stand... If... If I'm going to be a douchebag and be with the Institute, I may as well go all out. If we hit them hard, that will... And, uh, both, um... What's the word I'm looking for? It will uh, increase the casualties on both sides meaning we lose a lot of lives however our lives are synthetic they can be replaced however some of them might actually have a personality 
So that's where we got to think. However, these are not actual human beings. These are robots designed to kill if this is their main directorate. So we're not actually losing any lives, whereas the Brotherhood would be. If we hit them hard, it would spread the name of the Institute, but it might not be the best way possible. If we minimize the violence and try to come to a diplomatic standpoint, then we could be seen as negotiable. However, I know the Brotherhood won't negotiate with us. If we try to avoid conflict altogether, we'll be seen as cowards and they can walk all over us. What's wait and see option? Shouldn't we wait and see? Give the announcement some time to sink in before acting. That would be stupid. Sitting on our hands would only give them time to prepare. We've all agreed that action must be taken. As director, it's up to you and how we focus our efforts in achieving this goal. Okay. We'd like your input on what direction we should take. Do we increase synth production or focus on weapons development? Increasing weapon production or development will create better weapons, however, fewer numbers. Increasing synth production will give us more numbers with the weapons we already have. However, the Brotherhood has better weaponry. They have heavier weaponry. I gotta say weapon development. I've seen enough to know that weapons are the key to winning wars. Let's focus on weapons development. As you wish. The advanced systems folks will get to work immediately. Thank you very much for your time, sir. That's all we have for the moment. I believe Father wished to speak with you once our meeting concluded. Being the director of the Institute is a serious commitment. I hope you understand that. I didn't ask for the job, bitch! So we're defeating the Brotherhood. See, this is the kind of shit Matt Pat was talking about and saying that this is not the way to go about things. Obviously, the fucking Brotherhood is a problem. However, I don't believe eradication of which should be taken of. I mean, I don't like the Brotherhood. And I said I agreed with it, but I really don't. I mean, it's... It's pointless bloodshed in the end. But from a tactical standpoint, as they were talking about, but in terms of helping humanity in a whole, we need to actually treat people and help them and not just control them. You get what I'm saying? Okay, so I got I got to level up here. I guess I'm s speaking with father again. So all I do is talk to him. Jesus Christ. Why are you not in your fucking room, asshole? Are you back at the fucking reactors? Good at all Shut up. gonna be my catchphrase from this series is shut up holding our food supply hostage pigs and Loken are delusional if they think that's going to work sounds like things are pretty bad in bioscience I hope you can resolve the situation I don't give a fuck hey asshole ah there you are you've met with the director I assume they made their intentions known mm -hmm. it was difficult for them to reach the decision to engage in open hostility what about you you agree with their decision. There is no good answer. There's no good answer. Taking action puts us at risk, but inaction could be deadly. And yet, as a leader, you must make those hard choices. You know, Father, it's no secret that you worked with the railroad in order to first reach the Institute. The depth of your involvement with them has been called into question repeatedly. I'm sure you can guess by whom. The question is, where do you stand with them now? Do you count them amongst your allies? They do. Does it matter? Does it matter? What are you getting at? I think it's obvious. For the Institute's position in the Commonwealth to be secure, no. the railroad must be eliminated completely. As our primary above-ground operative and someone who has had previous contact with the railroad, you are in the best position to carry this out. So what I'm getting at, simply, is this. Are you willing to destroy them? This 
is the moment I was talking about. I could either stand with the railroad or I could not. I could stay with the uh, Institute. Are you following? Or I could not. What is the right answer? I don't believe the railroad should be destroyed. I don't. Is it necessary? Is this really necessary? I'm afraid it is. I take no pleasure in it, but it must be done. This could kick me out of the institute. In the institute. And it must be done now. Are you willing? No. I'm not. I won't do that to them. Even knowing that they would kill all of us, you included, to get what they want. I'm sorry, but consider this an order. It must be done. You ain't the director no more. Report when they've been eliminated. No. Listen, you shit. Sean, it's unfortunate that it's come to this. But there's really no other way. I'm not killing them. I took that a little personal, didn't I? All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to leave a like button. Hit that like button and leave a comment down below. And if you want to see more, be sure to subscribe to the channel. It does help me out. So once again, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye, everybody.